All right, so here's an update video for um, installing Cura for the LK1 and firmware update. Super easy and simple. So first of all, you're going to go to HTTPS semicolon slash slash whatever www.longer3d.com slash download um, whatever that is center piece of cake. Hopefully you guys can see that. Yes, you can. And you're going to go down to Cura Windows 4.4. You're going to download that and then don't run it. Just download it. Get it downloaded. Because uh, we're going to do a firmware update first because that will be easy. So you get that downloaded. Um, either Cura, Mac, Windows, whatever you got. Um, and then you're going to go down here to firmware and user manuals. LK1. No problem. Download center. And then, of course, you're going to get the newest one. Right? Definitely. Download that. And then you are going to extract your firmware. Uh, it should look like this after you download it. Right here, a little zip file. Uh, my computer's cool. Just open that up by clicking on it. And then you can go into the folders. There's your firmware and piece of cake instructions. So makes it super easy. So as long as you follow this video, you're golden. Uh, so I've already got one open here. Uh, let's open the instructions first. So you can read through that. Here we go. If I can slow down here. Uh, might as well pop it up big for you guys. Boom. Blah -de blah -de blah 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 and blah 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 and then some more blah blah blah. Piece of cake. I'll show you how to do that now. So uh, here's what your micro SD card should look like. This is your micro SD card. So uh, delete everything off of it because uh, you're gonna re-slice anything you've had sliced already on it, anyways. So you might as well just delete it. And then those are the only two things you're gonna have in it from this file right here, the firmware. Booyah. So you're gonna open this up, which that you downloaded. Um, the firmware update and then you're gonna open this file or unzip depending on your computer and then there's the instructions there's the firmware alright so yeah you will finish opening that up you'll open firmware you'll take these two files just like this and then you will copy or cut them and place them right inside your micro SD card and when you are done updating it after you've plugged it into your machine, make sure you delete these two files. Otherwise, it will update every time you plug this SD card into your 3D printer. So after you've done updated, just remember to delete those and then you can put your G codes back in and everything's good to go. Okay. So that is all done. And... And then you just pop that in, and it should have a loading bar. Leave it alone. Booyah, bang, you done. And then... Um, so, also, in this video, the, I'm just going to let you know that the update... I'm oh, sorry, this is really hard with the camera holding it. Um, the update also fixes your screen sensitivity. So, you can actually do stuff now. Isn't that amazing? No more like clicking the button like, come on, come on, come on. So that is really cool. Oh man, almost going to start on camera, almost press it up. Anyways, but yeah, so that will fix your screen with this update. No biggie. Peace out, bye. All right, so you're going to pull up Kira. You're going to boot into it. As far as settings, you're going to pick the Alpha Wise U20 and there's an update firmware there i didn't even know and after you pick the alpha wise u20 everything should be good to go you should basically just have it done like you shouldn't need to mess with anything like it should be done so as long as you've updated your firmware and then on the cura get the cura update to the newest one and uh, yeah click on alpha wise u20 and you should be golden golden I think that is it. 
pretty basic stuff. Right here it will have you at uh, printing in uh, 1.5 millimeter, uh, just so you know. So I changed mine to uh, 0.2. So whatever you want to do. There. Uh, I think that's the only thing I changed, you know, other than like, well, whatever. But you you can figure all this out yourself. Um, but yeah, that's the settings. So you're just going to want to go up a YSU 20. Boom. Update that. Update that. Get it all updated. Piece of cake. Looks like it's going to be another successful print. We've been busy. Busy boys. Yeah. Looking good up in here. Looking good. Booyah. Booyah. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah.